please welcome Mara Hutton, Executive Vice President of the Jeffrey Bean Foundation, to present the Jeffrey Bean Builders of Science Award. Ladies and gentlemen and honored guests, on behalf of Research America, it is fitting that the Jeffrey Bean Foundation present the Jeffrey Bean Builders of Science Award because we too are builders of science through our founding and fully funding the Jeffrey Bean Cancer Research Center at Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center. 100% of our net profits from Jeffrey Bean LLC funds our research center. Funding research, scientific research, not only improves the quality of lives, but also creates jobs. We call that healthy economics. And is reflected in Grand Rapids, Michigan, where in 1996, through the one billion, yes, B is in baby, billion dollars endowment from Jay and Betty Van Andel, the Van Andel Institute was established, which encompasses basic and translational research in fueling developments and treatments for cancer and neurodegenerative diseases, including Parkinson's. Under the very dedicated leadership of their son, David Van Andel, as chairman and CEO of the Van Andel Institute, he turned his parents' grand vision into a thriving reality. Home of three of the state, three, three state-of-the-art not-for-profit entities, the Van Andel Research Institute, the Graduate School, and the Education Institute. Over the past decade, the Van Andel Institute has made remarkable contributions to Michigan's economy by leveraging private and federal funding to create jobs while greatly expanding the life science industry. I mean, think about it. Isn't it fantastic how funding scientific research actually creates jobs? Remember that, Congress? <laughs> Thank you, David. Thank you for taking the lead for being a leader. It is great to see Mi Middle America make a contribution, a major contribution to the scientific industry. Now we're just waiting on Capitol Hill. Come on, Congress, do the right thing. They're doing a lot of right things at the Van Andel Institute. That's why tonight we have a twofer. As we all know, a builder of science demands that one of the, sci one of the builders be a scientist. Thus. The entrepreneur meets the rock star of science, renowned scientist, Dr. George Van der Wood. An expert in molecular oncology, Dr. Van der Wood was named founding director of research of the Van Andel Institute in 1999. His research career can be characterized by the uniquely broad scope of his work with the human oncogene MET. I was just speaking with him this evening. He's very proud of MET. When I was speaking to him, I thought it was his best friend, or who is this? It was like he embellished it. It, it was real, it's human. It, he, it was so passionate, it was so organic. It was exciting to speak to him with such passion. And his molecular partner, hepatocyte growth factor, HGF. And because they play an integral role in the process of cell survival, growth, blood vessel formation, and metastases, they are a significant ta target in the development of anti-cancer drugs. Inherent in rock star status is a scientist whose scorecard includes many firsts in discoveries, so here we go. Dr. Vanderwood was first to use recumbent DNA technology to isolate integrated forms of acute transforming retroviruses and compare their oncogenes to cellular proto-oncogenes. He was first to determine the structure and sequence of proviral long terminal repeats, LTR, to demonstrate their enhancer function of the LTR promoter and to show the utility of LTR expression vectors in eukaryotic cells. His laboratory was first to demonstrate that a normal cellular proto-oncogene could be activated as an oncogene. These findings provided a foundation for the search for active oncogenes in tumors. We love first. Rock on, Dr. Vander, Dr. Vanderwood. It's just 
amazing. And by the way, it may be a first that you've ever known a scientist who loves bees. I had the privilege of speaking with his four daughters at our table this evening, and I was so excited as they were talking about his, his interest in bees, and he got into the mask and the powder and put, you know, taping down his pants. And I'm, I'm thinking, this is a world-renowned scientist, and he's messing around with bees, these sweet little things. I, it's wonderful. You're so sweet. You're so sweet. And with rock star status comes many honors and prestigious awards. But with time constraints, I will only mention a few, including recently named a fellow of the AACR Academy. He was elected to the National Academy of Sciences and was elected a fellow in the American Academy of Arts and Sciences. Dr. Van der Wood is recipient of the National Institutes of Health Merit Award and a Lifetime Achievement Award in Technology Transfer from the National Aeronautics Space Administration. Bravo. Please join me and my husband, Tom, in congratulating both Dr. George Van der Wood and Mr. David Van Andel for receiving the Jeffrey Bean Builders of Science Award 2015. Great leaders.